so far, I'm impressed. Stewie, make sure you're not getting diseases from the things you do. Like, that's kind of nasty. Stewie also has only one place. That is so embarrassing. <laughs> what is living alone like? Oh my god. <laughs> My name is Dan. Welcome to the world of extra. Today is going to be an exciting day. It's a very requested video since my little gay brother moved out. Just a little bit of a recap. A few months ago, my little brother decided to move out. And everyone wants to know like what his life is like. So today, I decided to just surprise him. I'm gonna go to his place just to see his routine of the day. It is currently almost 10 a.m. So the day is just starting. I just want to see the day of a gay little university student brother. This is my outfit of the day. Is it so cute? Anyway, without any further ado, let's go to my little brother's apartment. I have made it to where my brother lives, but I'm going to give him a housewarming gift. I am thinking like fruits or donuts or candles, but knowing him, I know he's not gonna want the fucking fruits. I know he's not gonna want the fucking candles. Donuts it is. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff today because it's the morning. I just know he loves pondering good. Of course, I'm gonna get myself a custard one. Oh my god, it's so dangerous to buy food when I'm hungry. I haven't had breakfast, so I think I'm literally gonna get myself breakfast from here as well. I got a few of my favorites and Stevie's favorites as well. I got the donuts, everyone. So if you guys didn't know, I have lived in this town for four years, actually. Before that, I used to live for about a year in Nakano with my older brother. But Stubi ended up moving to this town as well because he ended up liking it. Fuck, the wind today is bad. I don't know, there's just a lot of things to do here, but also it's very, like, residential. I've definitely had a lot of memories here, especially because my best friend, Ayn, used to live here as well. So every time I'm back here, it just feels so nostalgic, and it feels like home still, honestly. But honestly, I would never give up living in Shibuya, like, moving Moving to Shibuya was probably one of the best decisions I've ever made. My life has really improved. And like, I've always been productive, even when I used to live here. But living in the heart of Tokyo, that's a different level of productivity. Like, I don't have to get ready, I don't have to commute. Anyway, the walk is kind of far, so I'll see you when I get there. Those are actually real DMs I get from you guys on Instagram. But I have an even better deal for you guys. Maybe even for an OLED Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Thank you so much to Timu for sponsoring this portion of this video. For those of you guys who don't know, Timu is an online marketplace that offers the most competitively priced products in multiple categories like fashion, jewelry, home decor, pet supplies, beauty, and more. I've actually been using the Timu. <laughs> Not me looking at the Kuromi Funko Pop last night. But I've actually been using the Timu iOS app for a little bit now. And let me tell you, you can find almost anything on this website. It's kind of crazy. The other day, I saw someone make a filter on TikTok of these really cool sunglasses. I really wanted them and BAM! Easy find under jewelry and accessories on Timu. Oh, this? $2 on Timu. You want a capybara plushie like the one I gave my boyfriend Ludwig on this video? Bow. $5 under toys and games on Timu. Ludwig and I are gonna start decorating the apartment together as well. So I really want to get this starry light projector for 64% off under home and kitchen. And a bunch of plushies to add to our collection like the star from Mario, the Takashi Murakami flower, a Totoro, a Kirby, a Kuromi, and maybe just a few more. As you guys will see throughout this video, I have discovered that one of my love languages in terms of giving is giving gifts and acts of service. And Timu is for sure the best place for gifts. Like, don't you want to give yourself this cute little deck for less than $5. They always have site-wide sales and sometimes it reaches 90% off. And on top of that, free shipping on your orders and free returns for 90 days. Available, of course, in the US, but have expanded to Canada, New Zealand, Australia, and so much more. It all honestly sounds too good to be true, huh? But let me add more. How about $100 worth of Timu Kiwans for everyone? Just click the link in my description box. And an extra 30% off for new users who use my code SALE9286. Or just click the link in my description box. Oh, and the OLED switch I was talking about? Timu and I teamed up to give you guys a discount on that as well. You can find the link in my description box, and of course, you can use all the deals I've mentioned. Again, use code SALE9286. Let me know in the comments how much you guys end up saving with my coupons. And thank you so much to Timu for sponsoring this video. We made it! Thank you, Mindes. Oh my god! <laughs> Really? <laughs> I'm gonna come in! Oh my god! OMG! Hi. Welcome. Wait, is this your first time coming here? Yeah! Since the move? Uh huh. Oh my god! Oh my god. 
<laughs> anyway, today I am going to follow you around so people know a day in Stewie's life. And you're also going to give a little bit of your life update. Are you down for that? Are you ready for that? Okay. <laughs> what time did you wake up today? I woke up at 8.30, but then I felt sleepy. So I slept for 30 more minutes and then woke up at night. Okay, so what have you done so far today? So I woke up, took a shower, and then did like one remote lesson here. What do you do for your job? <gasps> I teach English. Uh, an English teaching school. And how did you get the job? From you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I haven't had breakfast yet. Are you gonna feed me? <gasps> okay, let's have a little brekkie together. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, you look so good. Thank you. <laughs> you look so good too. <laughs> So let's have some sundubu. I made this like a few days ago. Because if you cook soup and you like eat it for a few days, it like saves money or whatever. Yeah, that's what I do too. But I usually cook Filipino food like mongo, sinigang, adobo. And I literally eat that for like a whole week. Okay, it looks a little bit nasty, so I'm gonna heat it up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't spill it in yet. <laughs> so what did you put in that? Just a lot of meat and a lot of ikchai. <laughs> Just two ingredients and... Okay, I'm gonna add egg in it to give it some <laughs> flavor. And also, we are gonna do like an updated house tour. It's barely a house, it's like a room. <laughs> We're gonna get groceries, but I'm gonna pay for him because I think he deserves it. Because Wait. the ingredients of your soup, it's so low budget. I'm gonna get you like better ingredients, okay? Wait, oh my god, thank you. You're welcome. But anyway, let's eat breakfast. I'm hungry as fuck. <laughs> Every time you put an egg, don't you have to add a little bit of salt? <laughs> also, what the fuck is that salt container? Peanuts. <laughs> Peanuts. Oh my god, let me add something to the shopping list. Salt shaker, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, while we're at it, let's just look at my kitchen. So as you have already seen, I'm trying to utilize every trash. That's good though, that's that good, I that's recycling. That's good for the environment. So my cup that I use to store my spoons... What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> okay, another thing in the shopping list. Let's add a cup holder. <laughs> and I haven't decided what I'm gonna use it for yet, but I also have this cook sticky container. <laughs> But this is honestly like university student life and he's experiencing all these like budget moves He knows how to like save money like cook food for the whole week and stuff and like recycle. Oh my god I'm so proud of you dude. We really see the growth. Everyone's saying we see the growth But let's keep on watching. Let's see his routine of the day because let's see because so far I'm impressed Okay Ew. Okay, one more thing that I recycled like my cup that I put all the clips in Oh my god, is that yogurt? It's yogurt. Ew, that one's nasty because that's paper. I watched it. But that's paper. And I tried it. <laughs> I can't believe his recycle era is so insane that he's using biodegradable trash for things like these. Okay, Stevie, maybe that's a little bit too much. Okay, it's looking a lot better now. It doesn't look as nasty. Mm, that's yummy. Yeah. Who taught you how to cook? Mom did. Yeah, right? Mama has been teaching you how to cook a lot of different recipes for like six months just to prepare you to live alone, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh. She's the one who taught me how to make sundubu, sinigang, all of those things. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, can't waste any soup. <laughs> <laughs> me! Me! <laughs> and then Stewie before dishes. <laughs> oh my god. I just know it. <laughs> Let me just throw this egg. <laughs> Wait a minute, wait. Is this your garbage disposal area? Yeah. Do you not have a trash can? Okay, another thing in the shopping list. Wait, so should I use a box? <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, so which plates are we gonna use? Wait, that's my only plate in the house. Are you kidding? <laughs> okay, let's just use these Tupperwares. Okay. <laughs> hey, look how orange that is. <laughs> it's been picking his nose again. <laughs> Don't be shy, come here, show me that. <laughs> show me that. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? This is, oh my god, this is so gross, y'all. What is this? A bunch of used tissues. <laughs> what is, why? So I can clean the kitchen with them. But there's like booger on this. 
It's always to just throw it away if I can clean the kitchen with it. <laughs> TV show cheap steaks. You have another candy <laughs> over here. Stewie, make sure you're not getting diseases from the things you do. Like, that's kind of nasty. You're right. This is the sundubi. Honestly, it looks so yummy. <laughs> the rice is so cold. Oh, I didn't hit it up. <laughs> mm. Is it good? No. Here it goes. I mean, bitch, I told you to add salt earlier, so you're welcome, I guess. <laughs> So the fans have a lot of questions for you actually. Oh. Just like an update about your life. How's uni going? Sending love from Cebu. It's going really well. I'm actually currently on break and school is going to start in like a few days. But I'm kind of excited because I realized if I have no school, I have way too much time on my hands. And it's just extra time to overthink everything. Can I have a clean piece of tissue please? Okay. <laughs> You wanna save it? <laughs> How are your grades? I'll just say there are a lot of C's. <laughs> oh my god! Really? Why? Okay, so in the first semester, I did really well. I think my mental health was pretty good in the first semester, so I got like... Only two C's <laughs> in the first semester. I've never gotten a C. Really? Yeah. So what's your GPA? Two point. Three, two, I think. Really? But did you guys know, like, Stewie, when he was in Cebu, he was actually top one in class. This one, a lot of people are asking, actually, especially after our last video together, and you already know what it's about. <laughs> it's just a variation of the same question, but how is your boyfriend like? How is being in love like? How is he? And someone said, too much information, bitch. <laughs> okay, but first... <laughs> okay, first of all, he is not my boyfriend. And second of all, I'm kind of scared he's watching this. If you're watching... <laughs> hi! <laughs> if you're um, watching, can you message him and say, Hi, I watched it, just so we know. That is so embarrassing. <laughs> okay, but first of all, he is not my boyfriend. Where are you finished? Wait, shit. <laughs> he's not my boyfriend. He was really nice. He was really hot. Hi. That was it. Anyway, he can't multitask eating and talking, so let's just let him eat. We're gonna answer a few more questions later, but we have a lot of things to do today, so let's get going. So we're done eating our little brunch, so we are going to have donuts at the loft. Let's go. Come here, you guys, come here. This is the loft. Ooh, it's so clean up here. Aww. It's the Winnie the Pooh you got in the Disney video. Yeah. <gasps> That's a lot. Yeah. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. This reminds me of before. I actually moved in here. We were also like eating snacks. On the That's lot. true. Yeah. Oh. And it was in the dark because the lights weren't on yet. Mm. We're just gonna enjoy this and let's get going. Do you have soy milk? No. <laughs> Shopping list. Stewie. What? What are you doing? I'm gonna register for courses for this semester. I might take a course about miming. <laughs> Stewie's just gonna choose his courses. I'm gonna take a nap because I woke up so early today. Yes! So we finished with the course registration. I helped him because I'm so used to registering for courses. I literally chose all the classes for him. Oh my god. So basically he just had school Monday to Wednesday from morning to like 4 p.m. And that's it. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Of course. And he ended up taking classes that he actually liked. Not just like random ass classes. Oh my god. Because he was about to take like really easy level zero Japanese classes just so he makes the credit. I'm like don't do that. Yeah. It's gonna be so boring. You literally speak Japanese. Anyway. We're on our way to Nito because I want to buy him a few things for his place. <laughs> Let's go. We made it to Nitori. Oh my god, I swear, Japanese weather is so bipolar because now it's summer. <laughs> like, yeah. what is this? Let's get Stewie some essentials because his place needs a little bit of help. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, so we made it to Nitori. I have the list of essentials. Let's get a little trash can. So, there's a lot of different types of bins. And Stubby obviously doesn't have a lot of space. So, we were thinking, I hate bins that don't have lids. And I think that's the problem with yours. So, your place kind of smells like... Shit. I think what you were imagining was like this type of vibe. You're like, I want a small one like that. No, thankfully we found this. That's so cute. Yeah. And it has a lid. The one in the back that people haven't touched yet. <laughs> okay, let's get this. Stewie also doesn't have a lot of spoons and forks. He only has like one set. So let's buy him this eight piece set. <laughs> <laughs> also, remember all the recycled little cups he uses? Let's buy him one of these. I think this one. <gasps> so it doesn't smell like shit in there. Cause like when you're putting wet things, it's good to have these holes. Right? Ooh, you're right? And it's so affordable. That's this one's so good, cute. huh? Thank you. 
<laughs> Jimmy also has only one plate, so let's buy him more plates. And it's cracked. Is it? We just found this really cute one, but it's literally plastic. So it won't break. And you can microwave it. Yeah, and you can put hot stuff in it. Wait, should we just get this? I think we should just get this. Yeah, let's get two. Wait, <laughs> Yeah. Okay, get the ones below. Do you want that white one or do you want that stony one? Wait, I'm so happy. Uh huh. And I think, like, if you get non breakable, like, melamine plastic ones like these, it's so much better because you're quicker at washing dishes. You don't have to worry about it breaking. Yeah. Which you obviously break. Okay, do you want, like, a air freshener or, like, a candle? Oh my god, wait. Yeah. Can I? Yeah, choose one. That's my favorite one, the green one. It's so good. It smells like bamboo. Freshly washed body. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> I think it's good to get like the ones that already have this though. Oh, Ew, yeah. This here. smells like spit. <laughs> sandalwood. I love sandalwood. I really like sandalwood. Okay, let's get that. The one in the back. <laughs> Ooh, here are the salt shakers. Do you want like this vibe? <gasps> There's a lot of holes. <laughs> this is gonna be cuter than my plate. <laughs> I'll just get the one in the front, don't overthink it. Yeah. Okay, the one in the middle. Okay, the one in the front. <laughs> what the fuck? We got it! Thank you! You're welcome! Can we please get KFC? Because look, like. You might get 550 and it's a whole set. Okay, let's do it. Okay! <laughs> Hi. So the people want to know what is living alone like? What have you learned so far? How's the experience? And etc. Um, I've learned how to become more independent and it's been so amazing because like I get to decide everything. The food I eat, like what I want to buy. So like, you love the freedom of everything? At first I was so scared of like, oh my god, I'm gonna have to cook for myself, clean for myself, wash my own clothes. But honestly, like those tasks are like kind of therapeutic. I kind of love it. That is good to know. But like sometimes I'll forget to cook or like I don't want to like take the time to heat up the soup. So what I do is I just like grab some rice, put some salt on it, and like eat it and say Ushi on the <laughs> He was also telling me about this one thing he does. So what I did recently, like I don't want to spend money on sweets that much, so I'm like ooh, dopamine detox, and then I'm just not gonna eat sweets. <laughs> <laughs> dopamine. Or I'll just eat plain rice, and I'm like ooh, rice is sugar. But recently I got a whole like pack of Free. sugars from like this cafe, so I'm planning on like putting sugar on the rice and then eating it and then saying ooh bibinga. <laughs> Also, remember when you were struggling with your social life a few months back? The people want to know, how's your social life going? Have you made any friends? And what's the tea? It's been so good. I've met so many people that I love. And Ooh. this is one girl. Shout out to you if you're watching Yudia. I fucking love Yudia. And Darren. I love them. They're my bestie. I'm so proud of Stevie for finding his people. He was always so worried because in high school, he didn't have a lot of friends because he didn't like the people in the school. I don't know. He just doesn't match the vibe of other people because, of course, Stevie is so unique and so charismatic and so fun. And everyone else is boring as well. Anyway, we're just gonna continue eating and let's go to say you. Don't mind him, he's just crying because we're going to the Blackpink concert on Saturday and it's going to be Tokyo <laughs> Dome, so he's just shook and it's just sinking in right now. <laughs> Life is so good. Anyway, we're at say you. We're at the supermarket right now and we gotta look at the list. Eggs, one of the most important university student ingredients ever. So affordable and that's a lot of protein and it's really healthy. Yeah. It's so easy to make. Just one? I think you're only allowed to get one, right? Really? That's oh so much true. That's because there's an egg shortage in Japan, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Stewie always uses, like, whatever he cooks, he will always, always use the really thinly sliced pork. This one from the budget store, because my mom actually is the one who always uses this because it's just so easy. And it cooks really fast. It's also really affordable. But let's get you this good meat. <laughs> okay, thank you. Wait, maybe two. <gasps> okay, for extra meat. Okay. Also, Stewie Sinigang is very budget friendly. Let's get him some fucking, like, okra. Oh like, you never put okra in your Sinigang. Oh my god, the okra in the Sinigang, yeah. Okay. I also cook Sinigang, so I know all the ingredients. Let's get him the good one. Do you even put tomatoes in your Sinigang? I bet not. I don't. These tomatoes just dice it in fourths. Wait, in this science, I see, like, parang ko cute tomato and like, ilalagay lang sa Sinigang. Is it okay? So. Why do you Should think we like that? that? Okay. <laughs> so he's like, don't get the expensive tomato. Just get it. Oh, it'd be so delicious. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, you're supposed to put it in, but yeah. I don't. Oh my god, I don't. You don't? Oh my god, so what, what's in your city guy? I bet you don't put chisto. I don't. Horenzo. Oh my god. Yep. <laughs> he's so happy. <laughs> do you have natto at home? No. Okay, let's get you two natto. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's how you know he's living alone because he's so happy with groceries. Like, that's how you know you're an adult. Like, getting free groceries is like the best thing in the world. It is. <laughs> I'm gonna be able to eat for like 
<laughs> orange. Wait, oh my god, not Wait, what orange. else? <laughs> Literally all the important ingredients he doesn't put. See tao. Now let's get some, you know, some treats, some snacks and sweets. Wait. <laughs> also, yeah, you should get some kimchi. No, not that cheap one. Treat yourself with Tak steaky. Thank you. Oh my god, and I know Stewie loves takuang, so let's get takuang. Wait, wait, really? <laughs> <laughs> As a university student, you have to get foods that don't go bad that fast. Something easy and yummy. Mabodoku. The ingredients is just like right there. Tofu and meat, you want it? And also, let's get Stewie golden curry, of course. Wait, I've never... I know he hasn't been having any like sausage. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> you deserve it, you deserve it. And of course, the good soy milk from Kikoma. Let's make it too. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, Stewie, we're at the snack section. Go crazy, just choose anything you want. Literally anything. Don't hold back, don't be shy. <laughs> but only if you promise me that you're not gonna eat snacks just because you're lazy at cooking. Yeah, 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 only yeah, eat yeah. snacks when you deserve it. You want Oreo? Wait, can I? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. I got the cheese one. Do you want it or no? I want it. Okay. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> the cookies? Do you want that? Yeah. Okay, which one has more? Lama? Bitch, don't think about the price or anything. If you want this one, then get it. Do you want this one? Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the OG, the ultimate one. <laughs> even more of an OG. And even more of an OG. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dreaming. <laughs> it's not just any dream, it's the dream. And Stewie, Stewie, do you want bread? Sweet's favorite food is bread. Let's go. Easy foods to cook. I think we should also get you these frozen foods because it's so easy to eat. Also gyoza. The gyoza one is really yummy. Oh no, you guys. It's Stewie's favorite section. <laughs> the bread section. I never get it because it's so expensive. Yeah. That one's really okay, then good. get that. The butter one or the raisin the one? The butter chocolate. One. The butter chocolate. Okay, okay. That okay. one looks untouched. <laughs> bag it. Yeah. Bag it, bag it. Wait, oh my god, thank you. <laughs> okay, we ended up buying way too much. It's not fitting in the bag. <laughs> that was such a successful grocery moment. <laughs> thank you so much. You're welcome. Anyway, let's go back to his place and let's just tidy up some things and just restock the fridge and let's just talk some more tea. Okay, let's restock the fridge. There's nothing in here. What is that smell? What smell? Is it the- Ew, it's the bathroom. Okay, here's the tea, you guys. Stewie is such a little cheap steak that he does not flush the toilet more than like what, twice a day? La la la. <laughs> like I opened the little lid and there was so much pee in there and he said he just like keeps it there and then flushes when it's ready. When it's ready. What the fuck do you even mean? Stewie's bathroom literally smells like a public bathroom. That is so embarrassing, Stewie. <laughs> And we still have some in the bin. Let's get rid of these. He's so happy about his little trash can. Thank you. You're welcome. Ooh, look at my little trash can. Ooh. And. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so far this is what Stewie's place looks like. There's a table over there. All the clothes are hanged over here. Now he has nowhere to put all his little snacks and stuff. He has like little trinkets in the bag. He just needs to like tidy it up a little bit. But I have a facial appointment in about an hour, so I have to go. such a busy fun day but we're kind of rushing because Stubi also has to go to work. On that note, the people want to know, how is it like having your own job while going to school and having to earn your own money and stuff? You feel more like you worked for your own money so you can do whatever you want with it. That's there's true. No, there's no like attachment to like mom gave this to me so I have to like learn how to save it or whatever. And bitch, you still do that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> he literally earns pretty good money because teaching English is like a prestigious job in Japan if you're a university student. So like he earns good money, but he still have a lot of like cheap steak habits. tendencies and habits. Yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. That was such a good, beautiful day. What do you have to say? Thank you so much. I'm so grateful and happy.
Oh, you're welcome. I'm, I'm so excited for life. That's good. That's good. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys again on my next video next week. Bye. Mm -hmm. Next time my visit to I'm going to get him these crate organizers on Timu under office and school supplies. It's literally less than $2. Honestly, let me double down and get him a whole rack to go with the organizer. How about that? It's 30% off and with a $100 coupon. Oh my god. It's free. Oh, and just a quick reminder in case you forgot, I partnered with Timu to give you guys $100 off as well and 30% off more for new users by using my code SALE9286 on Timu or by using my link in the description box. You can use these deals on both the website and on the app, on iOS and Android. So go shopping, bestie. Treat yourself, treat your loved ones. Match with me, get yourself an OLED Nintendo Switch and these glasses with my link in the description box. And again, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much to Timu for sponsoring this video. Mwah!